What's going on guys, Mr. Destiny here, bring you guys another video. Now, today, what I'm going to be talking about with you guys is a bit about the Tekken King and what's to come in Destiny. So, in the background, I've got just a bit of gameplay showing you guys what is there selling just in case you haven't looked. Now, you will be surprised, so yeah, if you haven't got something already, that's what I'm going to say. If you haven't got this certain weapon, you're in luck. Okay, so let's get started. So, the first thing that's coming to Destiny that I'm excited for is in fact the XP and level up system because before we only used to have to work towards a piece of armor and that would level us up and that would give us defense and that would be all we need now we have to focus on leveling up doing missions crucible whatever and then we have to focus on getting armor separately as well to, to higher our defense now that's gonna that, obviously that's gonna duplicate the playability so yeah, that's one thing that I'm excited for. That's a really big thing that they've done. I hope, I hope that they um they don't change that. I hope that it stays that way when they change it. So um, yeah, let's get into the second thing. The second thing I am excited for is the ghosts. Now, apparently, when in the Tekken King, there's going to be different kind of ghost shells, different ghosts, and they're all going to have give like an attribute or a boost, shall I say, to your character. Um, I'm not sure of all of them are, but I know that some can give a boost or an attribute give a boost an attribute or something to on your character so say just for an example I'm not sure if it, they can give an XP boost but say you have a ghost and it's, it will say time 10% um, XP boost or something like that then there you go your character will get a 10% XP boost uh, that's the kind of thing I mean uh, that's good because for a long time now destinies the ghosts in destiny have been useless they've just, they've just been the red one and then the normal one and you know there's not been much use for him but um yeah there's a lot more uses coming for the ghost you can scan things now um i think the ghost is going to tell you things about their, their new enemies and stuff like that so yeah that's good that they're bringing that into it um now the third thing that i'm really excited for is the exotic weapon in the dreadnought now um, if you haven't heard about this already there's supposed to be an exotic weapon coming and it's going to be broken up into 50 pieces and spread across the dreadnought now i don't know how you're going to get the parts for this weapon but um I think that there'll be there'll some will be spread across just so you can troll and find them. But then I also think that there'll be some that maybe you have to beat bosses for. I think that you have to beat Oryx to be able to get the last piece. That's what I think is going to happen. Or maybe that's not the last piece. Maybe you have to beat Oryx to get a piece. But then there's a lot more pieces with a lot more harder things to do. We don't even know what's going to happen. We don't. We haven't been on the dreadnought yet, but. Leave a comment down below telling me what you think about all these things coming into Destiny. Tell me which one you're most excited for. And yeah, guys, that's all I've got for you today. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.